part about it is that it's voted by my teammates, you know, so uh, that makes it special, you know, to be voted by them. And, um, you know, just being recognized is always an honor and um, just thankful, you know, for the organization and everything, for giving me opportunity and all that. Do you know who the uh, leader in the NFL is in terms of catch percentage? No, I don't. It would be you. <laughs> Does that um, mean anything to you? I mean, you're, no, you're catching the ball well? Yeah, it means a lot. You know, something that I try to work on, trying to be a complete back. Um, you know, I wish we won a couple more games, you know, so if the, if the stats and stuff are nice. But uh, I just got to continue my, doing my job and try to do it well. James, is that as much a sign of the game, the way the game has changed with Taylor getting all these balls? I think so, yeah. Um, you know, just being able to have another playmaker rather than just to be a, a guy who just trying to want to run between the tackles, um, being somebody who they can have out, you know, for a passing option. So, um, you know, the more you can do, you know, Coach T always talks about don't minimize your role. So just trying to be the best back I can be. What's the mindset despite the record right now, knowing that you're – you can't control your own destiny as a team right yeah, now. Yeah, man, um, we got a lot, a lot of football left. Um, you know, we got a great opportunity on Monday night. You know, we the only game on TV right there. Um, so, you know, our defense is playing great. You know, uh, we just got to pick it up and all, you know, the whole team. So, uh, we got a good opportunity on Monday night. So, that's just what we're focused on. Mason alluded to being aggressive on offense. Do you feel like you guys haven't been as aggressive as you? Like to so far. Um, I think you know we've been aggressive. Um, you know, just playmakers got to make plays. You know, you know, goes back to early on in the season converting on third downs and stuff. So we can be more aggressive. You know, we it's not that we weren't aggressive. It's just um, some situations that we were in. So uh, we'll be all right though. James, what does it mean for you guys to get Mason back? What's confidence you have in him? Um, uh, happy to have him back. First and foremost, happy he's healthy. You know, um, you know, aside from. You know, just having him back on the field. The good thing is he's healthy and he's out of protocol. Um, and so I'm uh, just it's happy to have him back. You know, he, he plays with a lot of passion. He's fired up about the opportunity, so I know he's going to, you know, prepare well this week and, and have a big game on Monday. What's it mean to have Rosie back? Man, uh, that's what I'm really excited about the most. <laughs> um, Pro Bowl fullback, just, um, you know, him leading the way, him going ahead first and the people, man. He. Uh, I need that, you know, we need a back where the whole offense is happy to have it back. Um, just his presence out there, you know, alone uh, in the special teams game, you know, he blocks punts. Um, be the first one down on the field making tackles on kickoff, so uh, he's a playmaker, so happy about that one. Do you suppose there's going to be more fullback usage? I hope so. Especially with the young quarterback? Yeah, I hope so. I need him. James, uh, played great. Miami this week. I mean, obviously the outside world is going to view this as a game. They're winless. Mm -hmm. Go winless. I mean, is it tough not to fall into the trap of underestimating a team? No, it's not tough. Um, you know, we, we 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 do this. You know, we understand that they're professional football players, and you know they had their fair share of close close losses. Um, so, um, you know, we, no, we going we, we're not going to take them lightly at all. They're, they're professionals as well, so it'll be you know a tough opportunity. Randy talks about using the passing game with the backs as run game alternatives. Do you consider those run game alternatives, or would you rather run the football? I just want to. I mean, I just want to win. Um, Y'all know me. You know, I give you know those answers, and that's and, that, and that's how I play this game. Uh, you know, uh, I just want to win the football game. So, um, you know, Benny, Jalen, that you know, you see, I, I said in the beginning of the season two, the load we kind of shared, and that's kind of what it's been to. Um, you know, when Jalen was in, getting you know equal amount of reps and stuff. So. Um, I just want to win the game no matter how, how, how that comes. Did you like what you saw out of Benny last game? Yeah, man. Running hard, fast, quick decisions, running downhill. Randy, Are you healthy? Randy Fickner, Randy Fickner has talked about ball security last week. Is feeling like you guys could have a couple more wins if not for fumbles or interceptions or what have you. How much of a point of emphasis has that been since uh, you know since the, the bye? And how much is, is, does it need to be a point of emphasis that you guys are well aware of what you need to do? Uh, it's always been a point of emphasis. And, you know, it, just because it's a point of emphasis don't mean that, you know, it's never going to happen. You know, you'll have those mistakes. Um, we don't want them and we don't expect them, but it's never going to be perfect. But uh, we're going to continue to work on it. We've been working on it before, you know, it happened this season, and uh, we continue to work on it, um, you know, moving forward. So just be something that we do.